All right, everyone, and welcome back. My name is Z Free, and for today's video, we have some pretty big announcement to make, and that is that later on today, in fact, we are going to be doing a stream, and it'll be having you guys know Hydros, and we don't care about Hydros, he'll, he'll be there, but it'll have Hydros and it'll have Gaming Claw. So if you guys are, are not familiar with Alex, uh, really, you have to have been a part of the Dokkan community uh, back in the 2016-17 area uh, because he hasn't produced content since then, and he recently came back to his channel with Breakers content. So we're going to be doing a Breakers stream later featuring those two guys, and we'll be giving away 10 uh, Steam codes. Ten, it might be a little more, at least 10 Steam codes for the game for you guys to be able to play. And it won't be just the, the regular one. It'll have like the pre-order bonus and stuff. So be sure to tune in. That'll be later on today at 2 o'clock p.m. Pacific Standard Time. You'll see that notification in your box as well. That being said, for the rest of this video, uh, my, my legends peeps, we are here to check out SS4 Vegeta. So if you haven't seen, I have been on a GT kick over the last few weeks, uh, even before we kind of realized that GT might be really happening here. It was the uh, video I did on SS4 Goku, and I did a video on Super Baby uh, 2, and now we're finally completing the trifecta. All three of these characters came out together. Their videos are about one week apart. I'll leave those other ones down below in the description but we have super saiyan 4 vegeta for this video so really truthfully and honestly the best thing in vegeta's kit in my opinion is this effect here where he boosts allies damage by 25 percent and he boosts allies and obviously this applies to himself special move and ultimate damage right here awakened too but there's not a lot of awakened arts characters in the game anyways but yeah this support stuff in my opinion is the best thing and what i'll say is if you watch the pan video recently um <clears throat> one thing i said about the gt team is they have a crap ton of support uh of throughout a lot of different kits this guy has it pan by the way pan is ridiculous hey hold on let me say this pan may, may legitimately be the best gt character in the game i know that's that sounds really hard to say with lfs here and stuff but pan is really freaking good <laughs> and she does a lot of she has so many damage buffs she has a lot of damage buffs. She does a lot of damage. So, nonetheless, Pan has all of her support and stuff like that. Uh, you know, if she's not the best, she's she's definitely not any worse than second best, in my opinion. Anyways, SS4 Vegeta here, or SS uh, Vegeta here, excuse me, on Zenkai, does offer support here, too. So, we're going to be pairing him with those guys. And there's other characters like Oob and, and, and other characters that offer support for the team overall. So, I'm excited about this, and I hope that he looks pretty good. He doesn't have uh, a lot of utility in terms of uh, some of the things you would like to see on a lot of characters today but what he does do is he gets a lot of damage when he enters the battlefield he gets a general damage boost of 40 percent and then another boost of 40 percent for blast damage only while picking up key he also has a card cost down for blast arts and he has a draw speed bonus and plus 40 percent to the next arts damage inflicted when the enemy switches while this character is on the battlefield so if they switch versus him you see this a lot with characters like this where they're designed to be damage dealers and they, they do the pressure and your opponent feels like they're pressured excuse me to uh switch out and then they, they they take they take you know advantage of that right uh it's on a lot of characters like cooler and i believe broly picked it up like it, it's always here um and in different variations vegeta only gets that a lot of characters like super 17 the the free to play one he picks up a card right doesn't he get key as well uh so like there's a lot of different variations of it this is okay but i would probably rather have a different variation but it is what it is uh also whenever he uh, enters the battlefield he gets key recovery and blue card cost down he also is one of the few characters there's only probably like three or four characters in the entire game that have anti-blast armor so he does plus 100 percent damage to enemies that use blast arts uh when they fly through his cards last but not least he gets defense all the way down here in a whopping 15 percent and he has some more damage as well down here so as you see <clears throat> another 15 cut too as you see he is built for damage unfortunately unlike goku who's more of an all-arounder vegeta doesn't have access to nullify covers so you have to really kind of play a specific way with him but with the draw speed with the green also producing more blasts uh he will be really powerful you know back in the day they designed him to be used alongside goku that's not something i think you can really do uh in today's meta or the climate of today but what i will because just the, you could do it but just the alternating play styles it's not peak like you can do anything it's just it's not optimal to do anyway Anyways, that being said, he does do this debuff for strike damage. If he came out today, he would just he would just do blast damage to help himself do further damage. Or or he would be like freaking Vegito, L or L U L Vegito, who just does general damage, right? Uh, I'm pretty sure he just does general damage because that's that's the way they like to do things now. Um, I digress. <clears throat> so Goku had the strikes that do minus blast, so you would be able to use your combo, then flip to Vegito. But that was like wonky anyway. 
because it's for like 15 counts, but you're going to I, I probably, right, probably be out of key and reset to neutral and need to get priority again. It's just it's just a won wonky thing to try to rely on. Um, so I'll leave you with this. I think Vegeta's solid, um, but I, I don't think he's a character that if they decide to do to do more characters for GT soon, I don't think he's a character you'll see anymore uh, on this team optimally anymore. But again, run what you want. So that being said, uh, there are a few characters on this team I think that could be in that position, though. That being said, I hope you guys enjoy, and here we go. Gotcha. Nice. Let's do a quick switch. Blue. Hopefully it was going to be Blue Goku. He didn't switch at all. Oh. Don't have a strike. Thank you. That's the only thing I was really, really hoping. Oh, this is another laggy match. Damn, that's two in a row. Wow, this is garbage. That's two in a row. I assume he's going to transform here. Yep. Let's see if we can get a tap punch in. Okay, that works. Because you still have to vanish. Aha! I'm gonna burn this now. So ensure if Gogeta was switching, he's gone. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. And I didn't want to drop the combo. That would have been the better play, you know. But this is definitely the safer play. Tackle. Oh, he ain't doing no damage. <laughs> I was excited to see the damage. Now I want him to take it back. He ain't doing nothing. Good lord. Not even this guy's doing anything. My Jimmy G just cracked. <laughs> Take it back. <laughs> Take it back. Dang, Majin Vegeta. Look at that. Nothing. Ugh. Well, goodbye, Majin Vegeta. You had a good defensive showing anyway. You know the crazy thing about the defense there was he didn't even use a bunch of cards, did he? Because he gets the extra cut. I don't remember him doing anything. Oh, I didn't want that. I actually wanted to do a dash in tap punch. Ironically, that happened as a result of him backdashing. It turned it into a tackle. So I'm using Vegeta's cover cut. You don't really want to switch too much versus this guy, I believe. I say things like I believe when I, I really know. <laughs> I've said it like three or four times throughout the last couple of matches. I know. It's just, you know, makes me feel and sound a little smart, I guess. Oh, good play. I'll get that Dragon Ball, though. Ah, I didn't get it. I was hoping to get the sidestep. Ooh. Oh, I was going to say, what is this nasty lag? Because <laughs> oh, it legit stalled for a whole second. All right, let's play the next one. All right, so we got future here. Well, hybrids, I guess. A little bit of both. But he's missing the number one hybrid. Pun -chun. Laggy, okay. That's cute. That's fine. Stay for now. Yeah, a little bit of lag. It's whatever. All right. Uh, after this hit, I think I'll go to Vegeta. Yep. Gonna use a green. Okay, that's fine. It's not ideal, but it's fine. Don't touch his body like that. You don't know him like that. Oh, okay, lag. All right. I didn't even sidestep like I asked. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness, lag. <laughs> You're beautiful. Now that, don't let anybody tell you otherwise, either. You are beautiful. I'm sidestepping. Let's see if he gets me. Thanks for the tap punches. Dude, come on. <laughs> what the? This match is getting worse, not better. Okay, this is going to be a chipmunk match. Just for the record, I typically do chipmunk on matches that are, like, excessively laggy. Can I use some? Okay. I was hoping to get, like, a, a, a stop clock something so I could rush. I mean, I could easily rush there, but I'm not going to. I'll take that instead. Let's go. 
I'm pretty sure this doesn't nullify, but he may not know that. Yeah, he didn't know that. I'm, it, it might. It might. I might be wrong. <clears throat> I need to double check. But since it faints, I'm pretty sure it doesn't nullify. However, what a waste of a faint. Huh. I'll throw a quick blast art here and get that blast damage as well. It might land. If it lands, he's done. Uh, no. We're going to throw the blue now. Let's we'll see if he vanishes. He did not. He would have to switch first, by the way, is what I meant. Not a single tap. Yeah! Yeah! Uh-huh! Get him! Get him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can just imagine how that sounds with the chipmunk. <laughs> Sometimes me being silly is hilarious with chipmunk. Oh! Whatever. She's the one that, you know, offers defeated buffs and stuff, whatever. Actually, the yellow Vegeta does too, I believe. So, okay. Destroy Dragon Balls. What Dragon Balls? Exact same scenario as earlier. <laughs> exact same result. Nice. Okay, let's switch here. I might get a quick vanish tack. Oh, he did that instead. Okay, that's fair. Maybe I'll get a perfect. Thank you. <laughs> Wait a minute. He used blast armor. So that, that also triggered the anti armor. So I did 100% extra damage, right? <laughs> let's go. Are we serious? What the? What? The, the game hella lagged and just came in with him using that card? What is that? That's garbage. I should have actually put Pan in. What in the world? Okay, but it's at full speed now. What was that? <laughs> oh, Legends is not having a good day, apparently. But see, it's full speed. So it wasn't either of us. It was a stupid game. That is something else, dude. You gonna cover here to Broly? Yeah. I knew it. People always do that. Always do that. That literally always works. Not always, but it works kind of often. He's gonna have to go to cooler here. Yeah. I wonder if you wait. If I waited. If I took long enough to get Broly in. Uh, okay, well, I need to faint because this won't kill. Of course. I really needed the faint. Oh, well. That's not going to work, buddy. Damn. Can I get the perfect here? Ooh, good adjustment. I, sh I knew I should have drawn my main and did that instead. But I went for the perfect vanish. That's okay. Whoa, he got lucky there. He was going full screen. He was going to cancel it, though. I don't love having to switch here. I'm going to have to be a little more patient because I got I got got there all because I got aggressive. Don't. Okay. Wow. I literally clicked that late. Yeah, thank you. He's gonna get his gauge here after this next card. It's a shame I can't do anything here, but I expect him to switch. He sidestepped, I'm gonna use the strike. Okay. Good patience. However, my Vegeta's back already, so I'm not really worried. Pan's green is pretty crazy for the sub count stuff. Hmm. OK. 
Okay, this guy's being really aggressive. Let's end short. Ah! Oh my god, man. He's getting everything with this cooler. Everything. And he even heals. Oh my goodness. Goodbye, cooler. Finally. I didn't expect the dash in. <clears throat> wonder how close he is to another rush. That's my question. Okay, I can throw SS4 into a ultimate. Unless he uses a green, which he did not. Strike? No. Okay, that's fine. I wanted to get that gauge off. That's why I did the tap shot first anyway. Yeah, nice try. I'm sick of those tackles! <clears throat> At least Vegeta's tanking fine. He's getting me on all those. He's making all the adjustments he needs, and I'm not. I'm going to have to sacrifice Pan here, because I can't have him getting another rush easily. I'm going to enter and just throw the blue here. The green made him neutral, so Vegeta's probably dead. Nice. I'm going to go for another. I knew it. Does he have a blue? Let's find out. Nice. The problem is Broly's stupid gauge. Can I get my last Dragon Ball? Okay, that's actually not bad. As long as he doesn't have a blue, which he probably does. Well, green works too, I guess. There we go. I'm going to start with the blast here. I knew it. Oh my god, he destroyed my card and healed. Get out of here, freaking Broly. He was literally dead and he destroyed the card. Get out. I should have went for tap punches there. Oh my god, I'm stupid. However, however, I can enter and use a blue. He needs to rush here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I had the blast and he was dead. Okay, quick attack. Oh! <laughs> God! I'm happy we pulled that off because he was kicking my butt for a stretch in there. Ah! Oh. oh my God! Other side. Oh, wow! I hope he brings him. He's in the leader slot and everything. I hope he brings him. Yeah, baby! I knew he'd take that bait. Ooh, girl. And since they're in, he had no option for the cover. Gotcha there. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. See if I get the sidestep. What? Goku switch. Yeah. 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 I even dropped for him. I'm going to use this green before I switch and go to Vegeta. Well, they're both Vegeta, but... Oh, I knew I should have just did a sidestep. Oh, we got a perfect... Uh, that's where you say no. Like I was saying, yeah, second ago, that's where you say no. No. <laughs> Hey, chill, dog. Zamasu? Oh, okay. There he goes. And we'll get another buff for this switch, boy. And then it was a one on one with two apes. Show me that tackle again. I think he is doing it. Whoa, I should have changed my card. 
Oh, good drift. I thought he'd sidestep. Really good drift. All right. I'm going to leave him. Let's see what happens. He'll probably pull his ult and win with the ult in this matchup of the S4s. Come on, Vegeta. Show him you're superior. So Vegeta doesn't have a lot of defense. He only really has defense on the cover, which this is not a cover. And whoof. No, he, he broke our sacred code. I almost got out of that. If I thought he was going to rush, I would have just did a strike. But I mean, it doesn't really matter. I mean, he's not beating GT Vegeta. <clears throat> so, yeah. <laughs> well, at least Vegeta did. Well, this GT Vegeta, you get my point. Uh, at least SS4 looks solid, did his thing, his thug fizzle, if you might, if you will. Uh, he was all right in the video. I, 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 was, I had fun using him. Um, definitely nothing special, though. He doesn't really have any utility, unfortunately. So Goku, Goku actually has utility with the no switch blue, uh, the support built in. He has the, um, he has the, um, the uh, nullify cover change. He also has nullify endurance, doesn't he? He's, so Goku, Goku has like everything. Like he really, he really does. Goku is a really good Zenkai. Uh, Vegeta has some other stuff. Don't get me wrong. Like he has, he has a lot of damage, but he doesn't do a lot of those other intangible things. But he has faint. Um, so I, and he also has the support effects. I don't want to sell him too short. It's just it, on the hierarchy of best things you want to have. Goku has basically everything. So it is what it is. Um, and and Goku's a better defensive character too with his consistent healing and stuff. So anyways, nonetheless though, um, Vegeta, I. I if GT gets a really strong, like, uh, platinum equip um, that has an option for blast attack, there, there might be some other ones that have awoken recently that I, I could have and probably should have used. But if they get that, I think that Vegeta could be really, really good. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Hit the thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. And remember, check out that stream.